What's up, guys? So I was getting ready to go to the gym. I looked in the mirror. I was like, dang, I kind of like a Calvin Klein model. Hold on. I was like, I hit a pose and like I look really good. I just can't get the pose right down in the mirror. Like it looks good, like when I'm by myself, but then as soon as I turn the camera on, it doesn't look as good, which is really annoying. Man, hold on, wait. You gonna get this right. Dang it! Ah! I just felt like I looked really cool earlier, but now I can't get it on camera. So maybe I'm just tripping. Maybe my mind's doing mental backflips. Man, whatever. But um, anyways, I started this cut at 195 pounds. It's been about two weeks, so now I'm down to 191. I'm 191 pounds down from 195 pounds, so that's a big accomplishment. Don't you love me, girl? Ooh, yeah. Mm-hmm. The other guy Bridget Once more tripped out dog Is they sisters Nah, you ain't listen They black They sisters They mama named them after white bitches Like what is this music dog? Like What is this? <laughs> what kind of music is this? <laughs> oh. I had to go in the office and change the music Cause I, I just can't live to that music So we got some Migos playing Hold on, listen to this. Uh, yeah. <laughs> okay guys, so before deadlifting, I like to warm up my glutes. So I'm here on the hip abduction machine and I'm gonna do three sets of 15. Don't judge me. Okay guys, so we're about to start my last workout on this strength cycle for this powerlifting program because then after that, on Monday, we start my peaking cycle for my powerlifting meet which is going to be February 18th and that's going to put me four weeks out. So, this is the last workout and after that, we put the blinders on and start focusing on what's next which is my powerlifting meet. So let's get this workout out of the way. I'm going to build up to my working set. I'm not, I think my working set today is 500 and... I want to say 585 pounds on deadlift, so that's going to be six plates. I have to check and make sure, but I'm pretty sure that's what I got today. But anyways, let's build up to the working set. Let's get started, man. Okay guys, so I checked my programming and I actually had a 4x4 of 585 pounds, so I think I was right initially when I set it the first time. But anyways, let's just go on with this set, man. This is the last deadlifting session of this powerlifting program. I feel like, I feel kind of light. I ate my usual breakfast. Maybe it's just the fact that I've lost four pounds over the course of two weeks, but it is what it is. My belt feels a little bit loose, but we'll work through everything, man. It's all good. Let's begin. Oh, Calvin parked behind me. I have no idea why. Explain yourself, sir. Can I help why'd you? you? Why'd you park behind me, man? 
I didn't know you were gonna leave because yesterday you were here for like four hours just talking to people. <laughs> so this whole time Kelvin has had. I also have this too. <laughs> what? Time Kelvin has had. Damn it, man, you're gonna push it out. This whole time Kelvin had my trophy. So That's I my think. Trophy. Okay, all right. <laughs> hey, huh? I'm about my dough today. I'm about my heart. Okay guys, so we got the ground turkey, mixed vegetables, and jasmine white rice right here for the post-workout meal. And over here, we're catching up on the Brilliant Idiots. So the Brilliant Idiots came out, um, today is Friday. It usually comes out on Thursday, and I missed the Thursday episode, so that was yesterday. And right now they have Tariq Nasheed on there. And I'm listening to Andrew Scholes and Tariq kind of like go back and forth and debating about like uh, white supremacy. So really interesting. Really interesting to be, watch to be listening to like after a workout. <laughs> okay guys, so I kind of want to talk to you about how I'm going to lose more weight going deeper into my cut. So this upcoming Monday, I'm going to be about four weeks out. Now I've noticed that with my, mac my current macros right now, which are 285 grams of carbs, 50 grams of fat, and 220 grams of protein, that I've already lost four pounds. So that puts me at 191, uh, probably 190 pounds. Now that's the weight I kind of want to stay around. Maybe drop, maybe drop two or three more pounds at the most. And the way I'm gonna do that is I'm gonna keep my macros exactly the same and I'm, gonna, and I'm going to introduce cardio into my weekly routine. So now I'm probably gonna be doing cardio um, two to three times a week and it'll be like 20 minute sessions every single time. So instead of changing my macros, I'm just gonna create a, a larger deficit by doing cardio. I feel like uh, I feel like I don't have to change anything with my macros. If I just wanna drop another one to three pounds, all I have to do is just introduce some cardio, make sure I'm consistent with my water intake and do a water cut so I'm able to cut down to the 183 pound weight class. So it's like, you know, at this point, like even I, I've lost four pounds, but I've been very consistent with my water intake. Like I'm supposed to be drinking a gallon a day. I probably get like, at the most half a gallon so I know once I'm able to get my gallon of water in every single day I know that may, I'm gonna shave off like probably like another pound to two pounds and then after that once I introduce cardio for the next four weeks because I'm still four weeks out from my competition I should drop down to the 188 187 uh, pound area and then after that all I have to do is do a water cut and, and a water cut should drop me another like six pounds in like two in like three days or two days. I actually, I remember one time whenever I was competing for the Aggie Show, yeah, I was competing for the Aggie Show now, I actually lost, um, I lost seven pounds in one night. So yeah, I just gotta make sure I'm consistently drinking my water. I got a glass right here, but that's gonna be my plan going forward into this new week, into my peaking cycle. I'm gonna keep my macros exactly the same. No need to drop my, my caloric intake. Just make sure that I'm able to um, create more of a deficit through cardio. No need to drop any more food from my diet. I feel like it's actually pretty cool because I, I didn't have to drop anything at any point. I haven't adjusted my macros because I kept seeing myself losing weight. Like uh, I kept at 285 grams of carbs and I was gonna monitor and see, hey, am I gonna lose weight eating this? And I did. So I've been losing weight. I feel good, I feel fine. And uh, you know, I think now it's kind of evening out because I haven't lost any weight in the last couple of days. So it's like, it's kind of even. So now I'm just gonna introduce cardio, create a larger deficit, and go from there. So that's my plan going forward. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like always, if you guys like this video, please like, comment, share, subscribe. Get better today. I'm out. Early in the morning trapping. Trap, trap. You can get them on your asking. I'm in the chicken. You can get them whichever way, nigga. Trap turns axe. Zag.